Hey everyone, let's talk about content and kind of, I want to tie this into our hope for your job search. So one thing I will say that I have had to learn is to stop being my own worst enemy. Why would you be enemies with the one person that you can never escape from, right? My grandmother used to say, everywhere you th- everywhere you go, there you are. And so I want you to kind of give yourself the grace to make mistakes, to be to be able to feel whatever it is that you're feeling and to walk through that and to trust God with it. So as I tie that back into your job search, one area I see a lot of people have a lot of apprehension is in what to post, what kind of content to create. And I don't want this to be an area of your life that you really feel stressed out and overwhelmed. There are ways around that. So let's look at a couple of ideas I have for content, and then we can talk about each one a little bit. Articles, those could be articles you wrote, they could be articles you read, industry related or not, something you found interesting. Chances are if you found it interesting, somebody else will too. So when you share that, you wanna post at least 12 words about it. Um, Any awards, if you see somebody else get an award, one of your target company is recognized with an award or maybe the CEO wins, you know, a Forbes award or, you know, best places to work award, then you can celebrate that tag the company and um, celebrate with them. If one of your colleagues or networking buddies gets an award, be, you know, recognize them, celebrate. Any books that you're reading, what you've learned, key takeaways, quotes, just remember when you're sharing other material, post at least 12 words about it. Celebrations, this could be celebrating small victories like interviews, it could be celebrating landings or celebrating other people. Um, Any certifications that you achieve or trainings that you attend, those would be great to post about. Encouragement for others, any helpful hints that you come across. So text plays change my job search. Let me share it with you. Those kind of things. Industry news, industry trends, any new technology, um, groundbreaking technology kind of stuff that shows you're on the forefront of what is happening in your industry any publications that mention you or that you want to make note of, especially if you know somebody who is mentioned or wrote the article, then you could definitely tag them. Quotes that inspire you. Recognition. I share scriptures a lot that is um, to do at your discretion. Uh, Stories. So any anecdotal kind of stories that tell a little bit about your job search maybe or your past work experiences would be good technologies that you've used, tools that you have implemented, or trainings that you've attended. Theme ideas. So some people feel more comfortable creating content based on themes. Monday motivation is always a trending topic. Talk about it Tuesday. So this would be a time to talk about anything that you have just kind of pressing on your heart or your mind, um, anything going on in society. Um, I, I steer clear of controversy, but definitely talk about something cool. Well Wishes Wednesday would be a good day to recognize other people, wishing them well. And then Thankful Thursday, let's talk about something we're thankful for, whether that's a life lesson learned, somebody that came into our life, a past experience. There's so many things that we could do with Thankful Thursday. Funny Friday, share something that's funny, makes you laugh. Maybe it'll make other people laugh too. I've also included the post times. I'll put this up on the wall, but hopefully that will help. Um, I, I really felt like more important than just sharing a message about hope, which I hope this does give you hope, but I want you guys to just relax and breathe and trust yourself and understand that you are worthy right now as is without changing anything to have a voice, to be heard, to create content. Um, this kind of fear of being out in the public eye in a professional light Guys, let's face that head on and understand that you deserve to post just as much as I do, as much as Trevor does or Foster or anybody in the network or any influencers, you deserve to have a voice. And LinkedIn was actually created for you to have a voice. So I want you to give yourself permission to just explore that. And um, whether it's videos or text only or pictures or just reshares for now, Get used to getting out there and having your thoughts be out in the public so you can build a brand that when people go to your profile, they know exactly who you are and what you represent. Talk to you soon. Have an amazing night. Bye.